Expedition Full Send. I'm Jana. Yeah, I'm Brandon. And today we're talking about breaking the internet. <laughs> breaking with, the internet. With <laughs> putting 37 inch tires on sport axles, Dana 30, Dana 35. Everybody wants to push beyond that 35 inch tire. Well, we're doing it. Now, when I started with my Jeep, I had no idea what I was doing. All I wanted to do was to be able to take the top off, let my hair blow in the wind, you know, take the doors off, drive naked in the summertime. That's really the only concern that I had. And I went on one trail ride in my little sport stock baby and caught the bug. And very soon after that, uh, put what I felt like were big tires on it at 33 inches <laughs> and um, went to an off-road event, uh, won a re-gear to the 513 gear ratio and that's kind of changed everything for us. For sure, well the 513 gears, it really changes the game in our opinion because putting 513 gears in the Dana 30 and Dana 35, you're gonna turn that 30, 37 inch tire so much better. Now mind you, if we were still running 321 gears, we would not put 37 inch tires on these axles. You know, that, that putting those gears in there just really changes the game there. We have discussed trussing the axles um, and it may be a thing that we pursue later on, but for right now, we're just like, yeah, why not try it? Let's give it a shot and see what happens. And just for the record, I can't hear you. Tinker Air Force Base. <laughs> Definitely go back and look at the other videos after this one to see all the adventures that we get into. Some and of it's the stupid. That we do. I mean, yeah, we, we, we tend to like to push the stupidness a little yeah, bit, a little but bit. you know, a little hey. bit. you guys drop us a comment below. Let us know what you think is going to happen. Uh, we're very curious to get your take on it. We know the internet hates people putting big tires <laughs> on a Dana 30. Um, or hey, if you've already done it and you've bent your axle, yeah. we would love to hear about it. And you know, like maybe we we could be friends <laughs> because <laughs> exactly. we're all about it. You know, so. We really do think that it has a lot to do with your finesse. It has a lot to do with the way you wheel. We like to crawl things. We like to put our Jeeps through the paces, but we like to do it with a little bit of finesse. Yep. So it really does come down to driver style. She's running uh, open diff in the front, posi traction in the rear, which we think helps a ton. Anyway, you guys follow along. Uh, be sure you're subscribed so that you won't miss what's coming out. Wrap knuckles, tape black Pick my gloves up off the mat Fighting's all I ever had Wasn't born with tons of gifts Had to work hard as a kid Know that everything I did Was to catch the other kids Slowly built that self-esteem Turned myself to a machine I'd compete so I'd be seen I would lose and I'd succeed But you'd never see me quit I'd always get after it Honestly, these have been fantastic tires For what we do, they've been really great it's just, uh, they're getting a little bit worn now. So there's still some life left in them, but like we knew we were gonna need to replace them soon. And those tires were a really great deal. So here we are. We're 19, 19 and an eight. 19 and one eight. One, one eight. <laughs> two clicks. Two, two kicks. be legendary till I'm dead and buried deep within a cemetery. I will fight never weary. I wanna be legendary. You guys watch this the internet does have useful information sometimes I didn't make a thing that is like this yeah that's where i got the idea but this is just a drawer front that i had is all it is and it's just routed on the end so i can get my fingers under it nice Coming out of the gate, I'll be last place. That's all right. I don't work at a fast pace. I'm a steady horse creeping up straight past me. What's the best? You know what's getting past me. I see people hit walls and they stop there. I don't get that mind, man. It sounds scared. Good things take time, better prepare. Because anything great takes pain, it's a fair. Oh, take it from me because I got to this place where no one can tell me to do anything. I call my own shots. I call my own place. I enjoy my life. Measure it. Hey, 19 and 8 before. We are at 21 and a quarter. She got a little boost. Nice. What's that? That's over two inches. That's what she said. Excuse me? That's what she said. Yeah. It's like a lift kit. Right? <laughs> I got a two and a quarter inch lift off of that. It's crazy. Crazy.
So now that we put these 37s on, we need to flash this and basically change the tire size so the speedometer is going to be right. Vehicle settings, tire size, 33 and a half, which just didn't, doesn't seem right. <laughs> what do we? 36 and a half. There you go. One eternity later. I feel there's something empty. We need something more. I feel destiny. She tempts me. Tells me there's two paths. They both have a different ending. Choose wise and you'll find that pain leads to ascending. Till I'm dead and buried deep within a cemetery. I do fight never weary. I wanna be legendary. Till I'm dead and buried deep within a cemetery. So we got the tires on. You can see they they fit beautifully with these fenders. Um, we didn't have to make any adjustments as far as the height or the bump stops or any of that stuff goes. Um, I love the stance that she has now. It's just so much tougher, like just big, like, ooh. and I love the lift that I got out of this thing too. I can't believe it, like over two inches just by going to these bigger tires from the 35s that I had on it. Um, additionally, I get way better gas mileage. My RPMs prior to this, when I was running 35s on those 513 gears was about 12 miles per gallon, which is like kind of cringy. <laughs> uh, but now that I've gone to these 37s and reprogrammed, you know, the super chips, it's actually, I'm getting close to 16, which is about what I had when everything was stock. So I'm super pleased with the way they look, the way they've turned out and really really excited to get them out on a trail when we were doing these tires we found that one of my shocks had actually blown and so it took us a minute to get those replaced but we finally did it went with some fox mono tubes there 2.0s 2.0s the weekend after next is when we'll have the opportunity to go out first uh, with our friends we're going to a new park uh, called twin mountains it's out in eastern oklahoma and we're really excited to get out there and kind of put her through the paces and see what happens. So you guys be sure that you're subscribed so you can follow along and uh, see what happens with these axles. I wanna be